Hi, I'm Stacy. This is a strength circuit workout. We've only got six moves today. Most are combo moves, so you're getting more bang for your buck. Um, we're gonna go through all six, take a little rest, and then repeat. All you need are dumbbells, and I'm using just two different size dumbbells. You're gonna want a heavier set and a medium set. So I'm gonna use 15 pounds and 10 pounds. Just for reference, you definitely need to adjust as needed and make sure you find that balance where you're challenging yourself, but it's doable. So those last few reps are hard, but you can do them. All right, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet. It supports me, it helps you get that notification when I share a new workout. And if you're looking for a structured program, you're not really sure how to piece your workouts together, I have a four week program. It's a one time purchase, so once you get it, it's yours. You have access, you can repeat it as many times as you want. Um, so you can check that out on fitnessmomness.com if you're interested in that. All right, let's get warmed up. Feet about hip width apart or a little bit wider. Let's just start with a squat, down and up, keeping the weight in the heels, chin and chest lifted, and does not have to be very big to start. We just wanna get everything nice and warm. And take it to a side lunge, tap it in. Again, lunge, tap it in. Last one, other side, lunge. Tap it in. Last one. All right, come to a plie squat. We're gonna squat, turn to a lunge. Squat, other way. Yeah. Two. One. Hold it here, reach, stretch your sides. Come in here. La la, la 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 la. Three, two, one. Stand it up, give me a little knee crunch and switch. Add a twist. And give me some big arm circles back. Come to your toes. <laughs> and forward, circle, rise to your toes. Twist it out, let those arms swing. Are you warm, ready to go? All right, you've got options for everything we're doing today. Our first move is a wall sit hammer curl. You get to choose. If you just want a little um, <laughs> depth here, or get as low as you want, or you can leave that wall sit out of it and just hammer curl. Hammer curl, palms are in, reach that full extension, come all the way up, all the way down. All right, this is your heavier set of dumbbells of the two. So if you're coming to the wall, I like to kind of rest my weights here as I slide down, find that perfect spot so your lower body is challenged right away. All right, ready? Find what works for you. Let's go, big inhale and curl, exhale. All the way up, all the way down. Quads engaged, core engaged, but focus on those biceps and really squeeze and engage. Give me five more. You got it. Use your breath. Exhale. Two more. One. All right, same thing to come out of it. You can rest those weights on your legs, come up safely, set one dumbbell down. We have a side lunge reach and press. So one side to start. Get nice and low. Press into this lunge. You reach low, reach high. Option to pop your heel up and flex that calf. So reach low, chin stays lifted, reach high. You ready? One side to start. Let's go deep into that lunge, press it up. You can keep that heel flat on the floor, or right here, just pop it up. 
no momentum. We are moving continuously, but I want you to find that muscle, not momentum. Four. Two more on this side. Last one. Switch it out, same thing. Reach low and high. Keeping that heel down if you want, or popping it up. Press into that lunge. Low, nice and low. Good. Halfway there on this side. Whew. Three, two, one. Set it down. We're going to continue with just one dumbbell. You have the option to hold a calf raise. So toes out, and then just trying to find your stability, you're going to wobble. We're using our core, especially, and calves to keep that balance. Tricep extension. You can grab your dumbbell a couple of different ways. I like it like this, right here. But you can also grab the sides. Just focus on keeping those elbows in. So tricep extension, and then that option to hold the calf raise. Are you ready? So if you want, come to your toes. Let's go down and up. Trying to keep those elbows in. Nice neutral neck. And here it is. Elbows are in, coming all the way down, all the way up. Should feel this in your triceps and your calves if you've got that calf raise. Four, three. Oh, come on, one more. Set it down. We're coming to our lighter set of weights. Grab water when you need it. Don't wait for me to remind you, you wanna stay hydrated. All right, we have a sumo squat, so it's nice and wide. Toes are slightly out, knees track over the toes. You come down, hold, two jabs. It's not a quick jab, it's a muscle not momentum, controlled jab. All right, but we're holding that sumo squat to challenge the lower body. All right, everybody got their weights? You ready? Bring them together, down and hold. Controlled, and bring it up. Now, if you feel right away, this weight might be a little bit much, that's okay, change it out. Always good to listen to your body and adjust as needed. I'm good for now. I might change out my weights here for rounds two or three. Keep it going. Whew. You get to hold as low as you want here. Four more, are you with me? Whew. Two. Last one. Down and hold. We're gonna keep those weights, but I'm gonna demo without it. All right, we have a wide row. I want you to hinge. Bend in your knees. Nice hinge. Palms are in, but we're coming wide for that row. Then palms face in, single reverse fly. So up and down. You wanna keep a slight bend in that elbow. Don't lock it out. Nice bend as you lift for that fly. Neck neutral. All right, don't look up and strain your neck. That's so why I'm showing you the moves now, so you don't have to look up and straighten your neck, all right? Ready? Hinge, palms in to start, and we're starting with that row, wide row. Up, palms in, single fly, row. Other side, fly, you got it. Try to focus, especially as you lower on that reverse fly. Lowering with intention and control. Alternating sides 
Every time we've got that nice hinge, row, fly. Core is engaged. One more each side. Wide row, come on. Last fly. Ooh, one move to go. You just need one of those light dumbbells. We're gonna hit one side at a time. You're just holding that dumbbell on either side. We're gonna work our core, abs and obliques. So, side crunch to start, and then front crunch right here. So you want all the balance on that other side. Plant your heel, spread your toes, grip the floor, soft bend in the knee, don't lock it out. Nice soft bend, protect your knees. You ready? Side crunch, front crunch, let's go. Side, bend your knee, front. Arms and legs straight, both bend, yes. You got it. If you wobble, that's okay. Halfway there on this side. Three more. Soft bend in that supporting leg. Last one. Whew, other side. Shift the weight, soft bend. Starting with that side crunch, you ready? Let's go, crunch and bend it to the front. Whew. This is our last move of the circuit. So you get a break after this. Push yourself, that break is coming. Halfway there on this side. Use your core, engage, abs and obliques. Three, whew, how are your shoulders? Last one. Mm. Who set it down. Good work. Round one is done. Grab some water. As you know, you customize for you what works for you today. Energy wise, time wise, mental energy, all of it, whatever works for you. If one round is plenty, you're good. You're good to go. If you want more, Stay for round two. If you want even more, stay for round three. We're gonna do it all again. All right, if you're with me, round two. Now's a good, <clears throat> excuse me. Now's a good time to adjust those weights. If you felt like you wanna go up or down for the medium set, the heavy set, or both, it's a good time to do that. We're gonna start with that wall sit hammer curl. Remember your options. You don't have to sit at all. You can come just barely down or all the way, up to you. Palms in, inhale, let's go. Focusing on your biceps. Look at them, squeeze, engage. Think about that muscle. Halfway there. Give me five more. Come all the way down. Last three. Last one. Set those weights on your legs. Shimmy back up the wall. All right, one dumbbell. Side lunge reach. You know what it is now. I don't have to demo. Let's get right to it. Deep into that lunge. Press. Keep that palm close to your body, right here. Bring it close to your body, come up, rotate. Yes. Don't forget about the lunge. You wanna use your lower body. Press through the heel, engage those quads. Whew. Three more. Two. Last one. Ooh, switch it out. Ready, right into it. Let's go. Lunge, press. How you feeling? 
Round two. <sighs> Move two. Halfway there on this side. All the way down, all the way up. Control. Whew. Three. Two. Last one. Yes. One dumbbell. Tricep extension. Option. Two. Calf raise hold. All right. Grabbing that dumbbell and elbows in. Let's go. Remember, if you wobble, that's okay. You're fighting for that balance the whole time. Calves engaged, core engaged, and really squeezing, engaging those triceps. Halfway there. Three. Exhale. Last one. Oh, set it down. All right, lighter weight. Sumo squat jab. This is a challenging one. You can jump down in those uh, dumbbell weights if you want from what you did the first time. I'm gonna try one more set with these. All right, wide. Knees track over toes, same direction. Ready? <laughs> down and hold. Control, jab. Control and rise. Let's go. Oh, my hands are getting slippery. I need some chalk or some gloves. These dumbbells are wanting to slide. You got it. Stay low, as low as you want in that sumo squat. Controlled jab. You got it. Stay with me. We're in it together. You're doing something great for your body today and your mind. I say this a lot, but for real, workouts are just as much for me mentally as they are physically. Three more. I was working through an injury recently, had to take a week off. I was not very mentally strong. <laughs> had to get back to those workouts to feel myself again. Last one. And set them down. Oh, all right. Same weight or a little lighter. Later, we have that wide row, single fly combo. Oh man. You can always dance it out. Or don't. Okay, two more moves. Two more moves for round two. Are you ready? Hinge, neutral neck, wide row, let's go. Single fly, wide row. Soft bend in that elbow on the single fly. Nice flat back, neutral neck. Row, fly. Two more each side. You've got this. We've got this. One more each. Wide row, single fly. This is it. Other side. Ow! One more move. One dumbbell. One side at a time. Side crunch, front crunch. Obliques and abs. You can always ditch the dumbbell and do this with body weight. Find that stability, soft bend in the supporting leg. Side crunch to start. Front, bend it in. Side. Home stretch. When you get to that last move of the round, oh, you get that little mental boost, like, okay, I got this. <laughs> Two more. Last one. Whoo. Other side. Let's go. Side crunch. Knee crunch. Whoo. You wobble. That's okay. Soft bend in that supporting leg. Oh man, shoulders are not off the hook. Halfway there this side, come on. Four more. 
Are you ready? Last one. Ready. Whew. Oh my goodness. Shake it out. Get some water. Are you ready? All right. You want to be done? Two rounds. Good to go. That was an awesome workout. You want one more round? Stay with me. I'm here. I'm here for you for one more round. If you're done, if you're stopping there, stretch it out. You want to bring that heart rate down safely. Give it a little stretch. It's going to be good for muscle recovery. All right. Are we about ready for round three? Six moves. Last time through. We got this. All right, heavy dumbbells. Remember, adjust as needed. You want to leave the wall sit out this time? Totally fine. If you're coming into it, set those weights on your legs. Find where that wall sit challenges you, but it's doable. Palms in. Starting with that hammer curl. Inhale. Let's go. Exhale. Come on. You're taking good care of your body. You're boosting your mental health. You're doing something kind for yourself today. It's hard, but it's good. Five more. Last one. Come out of it. Whew. Two songs in a row saying, are you ready? All right, we're ready. Round three, side lunge, reach, and press. Are you ready? Let's, are you ready? So cheesy. Let's go, reach, press, adjust that weight if you need to. It's your workout. You gotta find what works for you. Hug the body, close to the body as you rise, pulling it up, rotating your palms. Yes, palm. Singular. Four. Two. Last one. Oh yeah. Woo! Switch it out. Right into it. Let's go. Lunge. Remember that lower body. You're pressing in and out of that lunge. Engaging your quads. Halfway there, this side. Come on. Three more. Last one. Come on. Whew. Calf raise. Hold. If you want it, tricep extension. Ready? Let's go. If you wobble, that's okay. Focusing on trying to keep those elbows in, coming all the way down, all the way down, all the way up. Ooh, like I said, if you wobble, that's okay. You wanna drop your heels? That's okay too. Four, three. This is the last time you will do this. Today, two, one, oh, we're getting there. Three down, three to go. Come on, oh, it's gonna feel so good when we're done. Sumo squat, slow and controlled jab. Adjust those weights if you need to. Ready, let's go. Hold, control, control, bring it up. My palms are slippery. Whew. As long as you're safe, just be safe. <laughs> Adjust those weights if you need to. Grab some chalk or some gloves if you need to. Oh man, what do we have here? 10, 10 of these. Oh, I can do it, you can do it. We're halfway there. All right, five more, low hold. Just two more moves after this. Don't let your mind tell your body that you can't if you have more to give. 
two. Last one. Oh yeah. Mm. Oh, row fly. Oh, so close. I can taste it. Take a breath. Oh. See my hands slipping down my legs. All right, row fly. Let's go. Neutral neck, hinge, bend those knees. Wide row to start, let's go. Row, single fly. Down with control. It's continuous on the motion coming down, but you're in control. Don't let it drop, lower. We just have one more move after this. Two more each. Last one, wide row. Single fly, come on. Other side. Oh, set one down. Finish with that core. Remember you can ditch the dumbbell. Do this with body weight. Focus on abs and obliques. Let's go, let's knock this out. Let's get to that stretch. Soft bend the supporting leg. Side crunch and bend. You got it. Halfway there, this side. Home stretch. I played myself. Four to go. Two. One. Oh. Down for half a second. Back up, other side, finish strong. Ready, let's go. Side crunch, bend it in, front. Obliques, abs, yes, oh, almost there. Halfway there, this side, last five of the entire workout. Myself, three, two, this is it, one, oh. Oh, set it down. Oh, you made it. Way to go. All right, tell me in the comments if you made it to round three. I wanna hear. Whew. Tell me if you like the wall sit or not. It's love-hate for me. All right, let's hit our shoulders first. You can find the wall or a table or a chair. I'm gonna use my mat. Just prop your hands up, send your hips back, and press those shoulders down. We're gonna stretch it out and bring our heart rate down safely. All right, go ahead and release. Bring your feet together, straighten your legs. We're gonna stretch those hamstrings. All right, step one leg back. We're gonna come into a runner's lunge, knee down, pressing those hips down as much as you want, whatever feels good. And then I want you to rise, lift those hands, arms up. Back down, bring your foot in, switch out that lunge. Runner's lunge right here, knee down, pressing your hips down as much as you want. All right, ready, let's rise. and lower, bring that foot in, stand it up slowly, and let's stretch those inner thighs. Wide stance, come down, press your knees out with your hands or your forearms. One of my favorite stretches. One forearm down, reach up, your gaze follows your hand. Switch it out. Use this feeling, channel this feeling. You feel proud, you feel strong. Remember that next time you don't wanna start a workout. Remember, okay, but it feels so good afterwards. Stand it up, clasp those hands behind your back and open your shoulders, open your chest, look up. Now, 
You can stay right here. If you want to step a little wider and fold, my hands are slippery, fold, letting the arms hang heavy, you can. I literally can't keep my hands together. I'm gonna stay up for this one. <laughs> Listen to your body. Whew. Sweaty today. All right, shake it out. Bring one arm down the center of your back, right down the center, press that elbow, stretch it out. Switch sides. Way to go. Thanks for working out with me today. Give me a few deep breaths. Ready? Big inhale. Blow that air out. Again, I want you to hear your breath. Big inhale. Big exhale. And that is it. Way to go. Subscribe. Check out my program on fitnessmamas.com and have a great day.